Hi guys, it's Rebecca. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Today's video is going to be filmed in a different location. I just got home from work. It's a little bit dark um, in the room where I usually film uh, because it's already late in the afternoon and I wanted to post this video tomorrow but I'm gonna be very very busy tomorrow or today when you're watching this. So I, and I knew I wasn't gonna have time to film but I decided to do it today. I hope the lighting is okay. I am in my bathroom um, and then my bedroom's out here. So I'm like under the door frame in my bathroom. <laughs> uh, anyway, this is gonna be my second update for my Revenge of the Fifth project pan. I can't believe it, it's been a month since my last update. That's kind of crazy. I feel like I just made that update, but no, it's been a month already according to my YouTube. Um, I will leave it linked up here if you guys are interested to see how I was doing on my first update. But like I said, this is my second update and I've made some good progress, I think. Um, I will leave everybody who's doing this in the description box below. This was created by Amanda D. Everything's created <laughs> by either Amanda or Jessica. Um, but this one was, I don't know if it was both of them or just Amanda, I can't remember. Uh, but anyway, let me just show you guys how I'm doing with this project. I have finished one item already and that's what I'm going to start with and that's going to be Benefits High Beam. This is a little... Um, highlight and I took out the stopper and I even and I used a q-tip to like Get the product all the way from the bottom. There's still some product up here But I can't get it with the wand or with the q-tip. So this one's done and I'm happy that I got that one out then I have uh, good progress on three items The first one I'm going to show you guys is this little mini nail polish from Sephora formula X this is in the color Orbit, and that's my progress. At the first update, I was up here, and I've been wearing it quite a bit, um, almost exclusively on my toes and on my fingers too, except today. Um, I felt like wearing a little bit more color this week, so I used this one. But this is where I'm at on this one. It's a dark, like, navy blue color, and that's where I'm at right now. So pretty good progress. Um, I have to start doing my nails again with this one so I can get the progress going, but I think I'll be able to finish this one. I really do think that I'll be able to, so that's that one. Then I have my Mali eyeshadow stick in the color Cobalt. This is what it looks like, and that's my progress lines. When I first started, I was up here, last update and current update. So um, I use this as an eyeshadow base. I don't use it every day. Just because when it's really hot and I'm lazy, <laughs> I just do like an eyeliner like how you guys see. But that's approximation, an approximation of what my progress is. So very happy this is broken. I break everything. Hopefully I'll be able to get um, use out of this whole thing and get this one out of my collection before this project ends. And one that I'm not sure if it's done or not is this Maybelline um, The Rocket Mascara. This one, as you guys can see, like the packaging is starting to like flake off. Um, but I think this one's on its last leg. It's getting kind of dry, it's getting kind of clumpy, and I have to like really, really work it to get it to apply to my lashes. That's what the wand looks like. It's a rubber, rubble, rubber, rubber wand. Jeez, um, that's what it looks like. And I really think that this is on its last leg. For sure, I'll be able to, I think I'm gonna use it like two more weeks and I think this will be done because I'm really having a hard time getting anything to deposit. Um, you still get like a little bit of product on the tip of the wand like you, how you guys can see, but like I said, it's getting really dry and kind of goopy. So I started to having to layer this um, with another mascara. I'm using a little sample from MAC, but I can't remember the name of that mascara but that one is this that's this one I'm sure that'll be done by the end of this project and the last one it's an eyeshadow from this quad from covergirl this is drama eyes and I was working or I am working on this silver sh um, shade right here um, I don't know if you guys will be able to tell but I have like I have a nice dip going on like right here well actually right here on this side um, you guys can't really tell but I think I'm close to hitting pan um, on this side of the shadow this side right here 
So hopefully um, I can use hit pen. Sorry, that was my goal to hit pen, not to use up this whole thing because there's no way um, I'll be able to use it up completely. But um, I'm not using this every day. Again, uh, it's been so hot here that I get, ooh, I broke it more. Uh, it's been so hot here that I'm getting super lazy to do like a full eyeshadow look. Um, usually I've just been using my eyeliners that I have on other project pens as my eye makeup and that's it so anyway guys that is my update for my revenge of the fifth project pen I hope you guys enjoyed and wish me luck hopefully I can do a good um, more progress for the next update and I'll make sure to have the other girls linked here thanks for watching and I will see you on my next video